No doubt springtime here in the Rockies, it means one thing, actually it means a couple things. Great snow and also sale times and best equipment. This guy right here, that's Jeff Evans. He's with Christie Sports. We talk every single Thursday right here. Yeah, we talk. We talk about ski equipment, but we talk about other things. Sometimes, yeah, we do talk about some other things. That's off camera. Uh, it is spring. I mean, look behind us. There's our demographic. We have a lot of families that are here right now. A lot of people uh, that are up here in the mountains right now, ski vacations, but they're riding in the wrong boots. They're riding, usually, generally speaking, they're riding in boots too big. Mm -hmm. So if you're in the market for boots, now's the time to buy. Why, what's the big deal about boots? I hear, you know, varying things, but they say, you know, I'm a snowboarder, sorry, but as a skier, this is probably like the one true piece of equipment that you should have and have it custom fit. It's your connection to the ski, it's your connection to the snow. But the big deal is, is you know, older technology, what they did is they, they would fit, you know, you'd put the shell on and then they'd fill the shell to make it work. Now we make the shell fit your foot. So both things are formed. So both things are formed. So you, the, the, boot is precise and exact and you know you get a really good feel for the snow and also the weight of them the materials that they're made out of we've seen some great advances not only in the plastics but also the buckles yeah the buckles um, generally speaking like this particular boot this is a Fisher um, and this boot is about 20% lighter than most boots which is a big deal you're wa you're spending a lot of time walking around in them well when you're you know you're hanging from the your feet are hanging from the lift sure. and stuff that makes it that makes a huge difference yeah, carrying them in your bag getting yeah. on the plane weight is an issue when you say the size of it though I've seen this process it's pretty cool I mean you literally pack the entire thing around their foot and vacuum seal it down or pressure fit it down pressure it's it's actually a pressure fit Fisher uh, you know they had a vacuum process for their skis but it's actually we press the boot to your foot um, and it really works I mean if you have any kind of physical anomaly bone spurs uh, protruding ankle Bones. Bunions. Bunions. We can compensate for that. I always love that. That sticks out in my head. I was in a rental shop. It was your rental shop. It was at Christie's. And this woman was just took this one of your guys to the side. Now I've got this. It's a bunion. Do you know what a bunion is? And you, yes, ma'am. I know what it is. And he was getting her properly fitted because, you know, everyone has a different foot. All right. So so a bunion, you know, it's, it's a protrusion on your foot. But where did they get that name from? I don't know. Do you think, Paul Bunyan? <laughs> I mean, he had the first one. He could have had the first one. I don't know. <laughs> could have called it Paul. This is cool. How many different uh, variations of the boot are there? How many different styles of Fisher boots there's, can you do this? You know, there's there's uh, you know a handful for men, a handful for women. Um, but basically, I mean, we assess your foot, the width of your foot, how your foot looks, and then we make the decision which boot is going to fit you best. Um, you know, you don't. You can't buy boots because you got, you know, you got a Rossignol boot. Well, your foot's completely different than mine, so I can't have a Rossignol boot. I'm more of a, you know, Solomon or a head guy. I met a guy yesterday. I know we have to wrap it up right now. I met a guy yesterday. He just arrived into town, staying over in Vail. Won't name names. Was talking to him. He has 10-year-old skis. I didn't have the heart to tell him you should try something new. Then I mentioned powder skis to him with the conditions, and he's like, oh, no, like literally, ah. I love mine. And his wife's, honey, maybe you should listen to him. Maybe you should try. What's your answer on the conditions right now? Someone's on 10-year-old equipment. Uh, you want a, you know, a mid-fat. You want something probably 92 to 105 underfoot. And basically, you know, what you're doing with, with modern equipment is you're making it easier. You know, yeah. I mean, nowadays, all you have to do is tip the ski over, and it'll do the work for you. Yeah, and once easier. you understand that, boom, you're done. All right, we're closing it out. Store hours locations? Vail, 8 to 8, Avon, 8 to 8, and Beaver Creek, 8 to 7. You want to send it down to Sassy? He's got the weather coming up. Mark, Mark, get out there on those head titans today. It's going to be a perfect day. Take it away to the weather. <laughs>